What's going on guys, JB Tech here with another Cydia tweak for you guys and this one is called Slider Pro available from the Modemai i repo and this is free and what this allows you to do is actually change the settings for your slider on your lock screen as you can tell I do have JB Tech on there and I don't have the slider you can actually take that off which is awesome and today they updated it so you can actually simply tap on the slider and it will unlock without having you to unlock it by sliding it and if we go down to settings that does have several settings if we just click on slider pro settings and you can actually enable the month day and year so it can display that in that way or you can display the day month and year whichever way you prefer and it has all these different settings you can switch on or off and I do have the custom slider text which is on right now we just turn that on and actually, I haven't checked this out. Let me, I haven't, <laughs> I wonder if the emojis, I love the emojis. This is the way I love texting. Let's do a little Jersey Shore emoji. This is the way I do my fist pumping little man right here. That kind of sounded weird. <laughs> Let's do the Jersey Shore. Check that out. My little Italian Guido on my iPhone. Let's go ahead and turn that on. And it actually does work. That's awesome. <laughs> my little Guido right there there we go click on that and I'm just leave that for now there is different varieties where you can set your custom text or the hours minutes days month, months blah 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 you have so many ways to customize it here and if we scroll all the way down we do have optional settings we can actually hide the slider which is what I did and also you can have no light animate to a tap which means whenever you do that it won't have that little glowing effect going across it'll just have it like that so I'll leave that like that and then keep light animated which will keep it on of course and then hide slider background I actually don't know what that means I don't really know what that setting is I kept switching on and off and I really couldn't tell a difference uh, so I don't know what that means Maybe one of y'all guys can tell me down in the comment section below. That would be great. And then we have the tap slider to unlock. And I really don't have any use for that because I don't have the slider on there. So go ahead and turn that off. I don't know why I have that on. And you can also bypass the password. And then the camera in slider basically means you will have the camera in of the slider, of course. There you go. And we'll click on that to unlock it. And the custom, the custom slider text. Um, I guess it doesn't work for the icons. Let me double check. Turn that on and then go all the way down. Or actually it does. It disappeared now. Let's turn it on a little bit more. Yeah, it does. It actually works on emojis as well. So we go all the way to the max. This is how big they will be. It's not too big of size, but um <laughs> sorry. Mine is going crazy right now. That's dirty. Anyways, so we go to tap to unlock. And that's what I have right now. So if you tap that to turn it on, you'll simply have the little tap to unlock, which is what I have, of course, which is awesome. And on the Enable Slider Pro, if you have this off, these will not work up here, like the slider text and all that. So you have to switch that to on in order for that to turn on. And you will be able to see your text and all of that good stuff. So guys, that's it for this video tweak. It is called Slider Pro once again, available from the Modern My Eye repo for free. So you should definitely check this out so you can customize your slider. I like this because I just love tapping on the screen and just unlocking like that without having to slide it. I don't know, it's just, I just prefer it that way. But definitely check this out. Let me know what you think about it in the comment section below. And also, if you like this video, go ahead and hit that little like button in the bottom left. And any comments, suggestions, or anything like that for my next video, leave that in the comment section below. And if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button up top. It is free and you will be notified when I come out with my latest video. So definitely click on that. I appreciate all of you for watching. And until the next one, I will catch y'all later. Peace.